Wire Accelerator has been working with early stage tech startups from across the United States for the last few months. This brand new WT Enterprise Center program supports growth driven tech companies through coaching, mentorship, capital, and utilizing the strengths of the Texas Panhandle. So Kyla Fry is in with us today. She is the WT Enterprise Center Executive Director, joining us with more in a way that you can check out what these companies have been up to. And real quick, kind of get everybody a crash course on what the Wire Accelerator program is all about. Sure. So this is a brand new program of the WT Enterprise Center, and it's specifically focused on technology companies, which is a little bit different than what we've been doing for the past 18 years. It's also a full-time program. So these companies have come from across the United States. They've been at the Enterprise Center from 8 to 8 at night for 12 weeks now. Really? Yes. And we've been working really hard on helping them get ready for investment, on accelerating their company, and also getting access to regional corporations and customers in the area. I was going to say, that's all great for them, but it's also really good for our area too, right? Absolutely. So not only are we working on our economic diversification and supporting technology, but we're also creating new jobs for software engineers and computer developers and coding kids from Amarillo College and WT so that we're creating more jobs for them whenever they graduate. That's good. We want to try to keep them here instead Absolutely. of like sending them out the door. Tell us a little bit about Demo Day. Sure. So obviously this is the first one that's happened in yeah. Amarillo, so it's a big deal. Uh, but these companies, we have four companies that will be giving a three-minute pitch of what they've been working on for the past 12 weeks. Okay. So they're talking about their customer segments. They're talking about their industry. They're talking about, you know, projected financials, all of the things that, you know, potential investors and even the community wants to hear what they've been doing for the last yeah. 12 weeks. So how can the community get out and, and show a little support for these people who put in all of these yes. hours? How can we get involved? Absolutely. So they can come out to the Globe News Center on Thursday, November 21st. That's this Thursday. 4.30 is when we're going to start, and we'll have a production of pitches and some guest speakers, okay. some fun videos, and then we'll also have a reception following that will be upstairs, and we're going to have music, drinks, food, all sorts of things. All kinds of good stuff. Yes. Um, if, would, if I put you on the spot about the companies, okay. um, tell me a little bit. I've got them here. Um, is it Compare? Compare that. Yeah, compare that. Mm -hmm. What are they about? So Bob is actually from Chicago, and he's working on a comparative analysis tool for the automotive industry, and it can also transfer into other industries as well. Uh, but he's been doing some really neat things. And instead of just you know going on and looking at one car, you can pull a multitude of cars depending on the attributes you're looking for, um, different features, mileage, all of the things like that, and it actually produces a score. So instead of just showing you the cars, it produces a score based oh, wow. on what you're actually interested in. Very cool. What about yes. Jobsist? So Jobsist is a company from Borger, Texas. They're our local company, and they have a job costing and time tracking software for the construction business, but again, also can go into different industries. Oh. So. Okay. Planet. Planet Derek, he is from Van Alstine, Texas, and he was a former teacher, really neat. He has a passion for financial literacy, and so his application helps people from high school, middle school, all the way up to retirement age, and learning how to have financial literacy and budget and just be more aware of their finances so that they're smarter in what they're doing with their decision-making process. I love it. And the last one, just real quick, Truckle. Is it Truckel yeah. or Truckle? Truckle. Truckle. Yes. So Truckle is a transportation technology out of Dallas, Texas. And what they do is they help with the um, shipping logistics. So somebody behind their desk actually can see the the truck and the product all the way through the process of getting to the final destination. That's wonderful. Yeah. All right. Well, we appreciate it. Thank you. Again, go out and be a part of this. Uh, that demo day is coming up on, uh, what is it? Thursday, November 21st. This Thursday at 430 at the Globe News Center. Perfect. Okay. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. It is time to head into the leadership corner now. Coming up, our friend Jody Holland got a few tips to help you out in the workplace. He's going to talk about the importance of something called implied agreements.